and then when I come out of the chrysalis of knowledge and I have answers, to just do what I say. Adolf Hipster, 2017 or 20 or whenever it is. Fuck politics. Make Donald Trump look like a bitch! I'm actually gonna vote Zoltan, transhumanist party. Some badass shit there. No, it's intelligent. I mean, it's a shit show. It's a distraction. They're, everything that the government and the media is doing and uh, all of the curriculum and brainwashing our entire society, it's all to distract us from unifying and then alleviating ourselves from economic enslavement at the hands of the fucking rich people, basically. The fucking ruling class. And, you know, like, if we hate them and we're like, fuck it, I'm anonymous. I'm gonna buy me the fucking cool ass mask and and like be a coward and hide behind it and not have to like take any responsibility for what I say anywhere because I'm hiding behind a mask and nobody knows who I am. I'm, a, I'm gonna do that. I hate, I hate this fucking shit. And the rich people are like, well, we'll monetize your hate. We'll fucking enslave a bunch of Chinese people and then get you to be an economic slave in America doing our dirty work so that you can get the money to buy this fucking mask. <laughs> Do not see the ridiculousness of this. And then, um, Trump, Hillary, it doesn't fucking matter which one of them gets it. They're both a distraction. And they don't have any power. Their job's to take attention away from the ones that do. No, no president really has any power. And anyone that, like, tries or might have a chance of, like, waking up the sheep, causing an uprising or something, well, they, whatever, they kill him or they'll threaten his life and make him drop out of the race like they most likely did with Sanders. Yeah, right, you expect me to believe Sanders is a contender, has a chance, goes through all that, his whole year, his career politician, and he's got a chance of winning, and he just drops out and supports Hillary? Yeah, right. You expect me to believe that that motherfucker wasn't coerced? <laughs> yeah. So disappointed in the world. And uh, my mom, when she was voting for Obama all those years ago, she told me that if Obama didn't get pre the presidency, that she would move out of the country and she was done with America. And uh, I told her, well, oh, even if Obama gets presidency, nothing is going to change. So you might as well get to packing. Sure as shit, that's what happened. So I've known for a long time that it's a joke. Like when Obama says gun control anything, it's just to create a fire sale so all the gun nuts go and clean off all the surplus military 762 rounds they didn't put into fucking the Iraqis when they had to pull out of there and then they got to figure up another excuse to go to war somewhere else and then if they don't they'll just go to war on their own people make every every drug addict a, a villain and then terrorize them and make them live in fear their whole lives and fuck up their family and murder their dog and fucking economically enslave them let them get butt raped take away their rights Take away the right to vote so that they can't ever vote for a president that's gonna, you know, alleviate the bullshit. It's crushing dissenters. 